and playing in the best league. So why not to try, try on, you know? Yeah, like my season finished earlier, like in uh, March. And uh, in April, I start like preparing for myself for the train camp here, like somewhere. Like I know the date, the train camp going to be in uh, 21st September and uh, just start preparing myself. Wait, John just mentioned that this today wasn't about pushing you guys to just kill you guys. It was more about the will to win. You just mentioned that, that you just couldn't see all those guys finish. Now after it's over, was it just one of those ones that thank God it's over? Or was it just now you mentioned that you guys are going to be harder and get harder? It's just one of those things that now you guys know what you're expecting. You feel like you're going to Um. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, it's not. It wasn't the, today. wasn't to kill us, you know. Today was to let us know that it's about will, you know. Uh, tomorrow is going to be the same thing. It's going to be a tough day again tomorrow. And it's just just the way he coaches, you know. He's hard. He expects a lot from you, and so it's dig deep and, and figure it out, you know. Find find it deep within yourself and keep pushing. Push yourself to be the best you can possibly be. And he's trying to get that from from the top players all the way down. I mean, there's 60 some guys here at camp and he wants every single person to give their absolute best and leave nothing, nothing on the table. Wait, uh, uh, are you and Ronnie the very good friends on the ice since you guys are former teammates, I presume that you guys were pretty close. Yeah, yeah, he's uh, he's one of my best friends. We have, uh, we have some fun together. Uh, wait, the, the message both from, we talked to Chuck this morning, and we just definitely talked to John. And they both said that kind of the plan going in this year is to play the kids, that, that the, the young players, the prospects are going to get a real shot to earn jobs. Is that especially exciting to you, knowing that you know, you're coming into a camp where you have a real chance to uh, to earn a job and get real playing time? Yeah, I mean, that's that's the first time I've heard that, but that sounds awesome to me. I, I like that. I like that a lot. That's uh, I like it. Yep. Wait, do, you, do you still feel like a kid? I know. You know, your age is getting up there a little bit, but you haven't played so many games. You still feel like a kid, though. No? Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. You gotta gotta keep the uh, the inner kid within yourself all the time. Make sure you love what you do, enjoy it, have fun. Whatever you're doing, the fun stuff, you know, the stuff that's hard, stuff that sucks. Find a way to enjoy it, and it's uh, makes it a lot easier. All right, I'm on the flip side for you with having all these younger guys. Is it kind of good to have them? Of pushing, course. pushing you even of course yeah like especially like the young guys want to be in the league and the older guys like me like want to be in the league too like and and uh, it's just that competition you know like healthy competition young guys have a young body and they recover faster but like it's, it's, like, it's competition it's nice you're a guy who played a lot of different situations in the nhl power play penalty kill so on uh, how much do you think your versatility your chances. I don't know. I can play all situational. Like, take the pick. You know, like everything but goalie, huh? <laughs> I I can play goalie too. Like, you know, try. like they don't let me play there. Like five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks, guys. Thanks,